Hi everyone, I hope you guys are doing well. Today we are going to be doing a reading on Ross B and Chris Stokes and Marcus Houston. We're going to be seeing if the allegations in regards to Chris Stokes and Marcus Houston is true. I do many cases like this, especially in regards to just any physical or mental and spiritual abuse. I also do a lot of cases in regards to molestation as well, um, bringing justice to light. And I do a lot of missing children's cases. A lot of you guys even missing animals at times. I don't do that a lot um, because I'm still trying to tap into connecting a bit more with animals. You guys know that I love animals. I have 30 roosters and I have four dogs and cats and just a whole bunch of animals. So I always, you know, try to do um readings just to bring uh, situations to light and a lot of them has came to light and i'm glad that i have helped uh, many people in regards to this so we're going to uh bring justice to light just to see if either rasby is uh telling the truth or he's lying since marcus houston and chris stokes doesn't want to take a polygraph test if you guys don't know i have my spiritual shop where i sell sages and i sell a whole bunch of spiritual baths and sprays and i will soon sell candles which is really excited so follow me on my instagram so you can stay posted in regards to the candles because it's gonna be so lovely these candles and very affordable as well but if you wanted to cleanse yourself or you wanted to protect yourself or you wanted to protect a loved one check the link down below visit my shop section and get you some sage or any spiritual item especially when it comes down to cleanses a lot of my cleanses have been selling out like bonkers like it's kind of hard for me to keep stock of them because i make them by myself so it's really hard so if you're really wanting a spiritual bath and one of my spiritual baths well all of my spiritual baths are a very affordable price compared to certain spiritual cleanses if you go to a botanica shop they might charge you 200 or even more so mine is very low compared to everybody else's because i want to make sure that everybody is able to get their hands on it um, and as I mentioned in my previous videos, you're able to use the spiritual cleanse as holy water if you're wanting to do that because they are prayed on and they are blessed. I have one of my sages lit and, and I am sending healing light to anyone that's involved in the situation. I'm sending healing light to raspy because i do see that there's a little bit of trauma in his life and to anyone that is involved okay may the archangels help in regards to balancing raspy's heart chakra and throat chakra i do see there's a little bit of issues of getting his voice heard and getting a, a little bit of his voice across and this healing light that i'm sending towards his way is going to allow him to speak up a bit more and um anything in regards to just any blockages because i do see there's a few blockages in regards to his end um just gaining the success that he truly wants i'm asking for the archangels to open his pathway okay so I'm going to put my sage over there and you see how strong my sages are. So you could go check my shop down below um, because it's like really strong and it smells so lovely and you guys have been loving this a lot. So we're going to be asking the Archangels, did Marcus Houston molest or rape um, or had several intercourses with Raspy as Raspy claims? to make sure that <clears throat> okay i really want you guys to just see a little bit in regards to the shuffling the okay so what i'm being told that okay because the forgiveness card came up so what i'm being told in regards to just this whole situation i do see that um 
Marcus Houston, he feels very guilty in regards to this whole dynamic. I'm being told that he was enabled. So he was enabled, but to the point that he starts to feel a little bit confused and conflicted and start to like it a little bit but he wasn't sure how he was truly feeling i do see that he is forgiving but at the same time his ego is getting in the way for him to say i am sorry for the damage that i have caused you so what the angels are saying yes the allegations in regards to rasby and marcus houston are absolutely true this has been more than one time they just assure me in regards to marcus houston i do see that this has been with multiple people i keep on hearing there has been more than seven people that this has happened to so in regards to marcus houston your angels are saying it's best for you to just step up and say the truth in regards to this matter okay um, because this will follow you to the end of your life, the angels are saying. And this is going to come out more worse. If you speak up now, there's going to be a lot of scandal. Absolutely, your angels are saying. But if you don't speak up, your karma is on its way. Because this has been multiple people. But the thing about this, you have been mentally messed up your angels are saying you have been enabled you have been manipulated you have been tricked you have been brainwashed to be curious in regards to doing this to multiple men we could say young men so in regards to this what the archangels are saying is true okay next question angels okay this card wants to come out yes i was asking the angels just now did uh chris stokes molested um and have sexual intercourses with raspy and the yes card as you guys saw flew out flew out to my chest um what archangel michael is saying that chris stokes he has not only done this to women he has done this to more men than women um this has been going on since he was a young adult um around the age of like 21 ish the angels are saying even saying um in regards to him and the angels because you see there's two balls over here female male masculine energy feminine energy so what the angels are saying but this has been more male that he has been doing this to um because the angels are saying these are double digit numbers so this has been long going um the main reason why he has not speaking up in regards to this matter because there's too many business ties and if he speaks up in regards to this matter in regards to the allegations that has been thrown at him he's afraid of losing his livelihood he is afraid of losing all financial ties that he may have had and may have he's afraid of losing his credibility credibility but his credibility is starting to get a bit more damaged year after year the angels are saying because he is not living in his truth the angels are saying that he has a sexual illness meaning that he is addicted to sex um in regards to also watching um you know any sexual video such as pornographic um the angels are saying that this is a fetish that he has had in regards to boys he had found the boys he has slept with boys and young adults um this has been also going on in regards to just younger children i do see from around the age of seven eight to the age of it looks very big to like the age of like 19 20 around here 21 um from the age gaps the angels are saying that if this comes out to light which it will if he doesn't speak up um he will be prosecuted so it's best that he speaks up now and and and, and just live in his truth instead of just hiding and then everything will come out and he will get charged and he will be thrown in jail the angels are saying despite everything he will be you know prosecuted if anyone that has been molested sexually assaulted and or raped by marcus uh, uh and rape in regards to chris stokes and marcus houston um they will get charged if they want to cause prosecution they will go to jail if they want to because this is this is a criminal investigation the angels are saying if they really want to do this now in regards to ras b just kind of like 
um being suppressed the main reason why because uh archangel michael archangel michael he is the angel of justice he's the one that fights the devil and chris stokes has sold his soul to the devil so um anyone that tries to go against uh chris stokes will get attacked in regards to um the nasty negative spirit that he has been embarking with um so yes the allegations are true I'm being told that this has been in multiple locations, such as hotel rooms. I'm being told this has been in tours. I'm being told this has been in record studios. I'm being told that this is in what's in his home. This has been in multiple locations. I'm being told that he has threatened the livelihoods of many men and many women. There's going to be more accusation that's going to be coming out within these next five years if he does not speak up. If he does not speak up in his truth, if he does not take a polygraph test, his karma, his empire, or his finances, it will go down the drain. Any business deals that Market Houston tries to do within these next five years will go down the drain. If they don't speak up now, they're telling me to stop. Within these next few months, okay? The angels do not lie, guys. The angels do not lie, okay? So just like what they said, but it even says uh, within these next few months. So within these next few months, if they do not speak up, within these next few years, if they do not speak up, they're going to get a bad case of karma. It says over here, no need to worry because, you know, the truth will come out to light. Now let's just draw a different deck. We're just going to be using their um, mirror salon deck. We're going to see if there's any other messages in regards to this matter. Okay, angels, what else do you want to say in regards to this matter? Grass B has a lot of trauma. I do see that he has a little bit of PTSD as well. Anyone can send this to uh, Grass B if you guys would like. Because this reading, um, it's just to bring truth to the situation because those two men do not want to take a polygraph test and you know the spiritual world angels do not lie we have seen this time and time again with multiple videos and, and them just bringing the truth in regards to just situations so let's just see spiritual growth so they do see that there has been a little bit of blockages in regards to rasby due to the things that they have thrown to him not only um not only verbally um physically doing things behind the scenes but also spiritually this is basically calling on the devil asking for the devil to cause blockages and chaos in his life so um raspberry is very important just like I, I threw a little bit of you know sage towards your way so hopefully you know your pathway starts to clear up a little bit but it's also important to make sure that you connect a bit more with the spiritual world to connect a bit more with your angels and if you want to connect with wishes as well okay um so you're able to clear a bit more of your pathway allow more opportunities to come your way and that you could continue with your healing process so you're able to start healing other people your angels are saying, unfortunately, you know, this has happened to you, but you're able to take the lessons that you had endured and apply it to your life currently and start helping other people. Use your voice. They have cleared your, your throat chakra, so you should start seeing that you're going to speak up a bit more. Use your voice, use your platform to start healing um, younger children that has gone through any sort of abuse such as charity work or making your own charity or nonprofit organization or groups, okay? Camp, stuff like that. Courses or even being a motivational speaker. In regards to the PTSD, the angels want you, and it looks like counseling, the angels really want you to you know, continue, like let's say, doing counseling. Or, you know, if you want to, you could um, speak to a spiritual advisor to help you with, you know, balancing um, your energy, helping with the heart chakra, helping with the throat chakra, okay? And you're very intuitive as well, but you really need to tap that 
tap into that a bit more let's see what's in regards to the situation courting man so um there's a lot of people in the industry that knows in regards to chris stokes and there's a lot of people that was in the music industry that was signed or underneath chris stokes that has gone through this and chris stokes is a very sneaky very evil very conniving person so um he has caused a lot of damage to people's livelihoods um he has ruined a lot of business deals for people even new upcoming artists you will hear them once or twice and then you will not hear from them again because if anyone that was not in his favor he would make sure that they will have nothing like he would make sure that they're not like they don't get a chance in the music industry again and anyone that tries to get in, in advance or kind of get like an opportunity in the music industry he calls on you know negative spirits or his you know his mindset is very toxic so he throws stones at people's way he is a soul that's very envious and he doesn't like anyone on top of him anyone that tries to go on top of him he tries to bring them down so um he's a very sneaky guy and i'm being told that it's very hard for people to kind of speak up in regards to him um mm. In regards to mature man uh, Raspi do you have that issues let me know because I do see there's something in regards to just father issues it's like a little bit of trauma kind of like there's like an open heart that's like it needs to be filled in regards to just issues with your father me a little bit more healing in regards to that matter fun times so your angels are saying in regards to this um, it was kind of like blindsided because of the way that he was as well that he tried to um, he tried to manipulate people he tried to give like the glamorous life to people and then he would do his sneaky attack and just sleep with these people and trick people and really force them um, and he would really like try to like threaten them to, to sleep with him multiple times and just are saying so it's really 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 nasty uh let's see union marcus houston you're married you're married or you're in a relationship i keep on hearing marriage 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 you keep on repeating it so i have to say you're married mind you i don't, I don't know nothing okay so i'm just here i'm doing this uh because you know i truly feel feel sad you know i know a lot of people that have gone through the situation and you know nothing comes to lie because people are just very sneaky so um so they say that marcus houston is married so if anyone down below let me know if he's married or not okay but they keep on saying he's married there's a child that's here so it looks like he has a kid or they're planning for a baby seeing a baby bump but there's a child that's here but You're not an easy partner. Um, you are very stubborn. You're very stubborn. You could be sweet, but you're very stubborn, Nangers are saying, and you really need to be a bit more gentle, um, a bit more. You're a good guy, but in regards to your partner, okay? But you need to stop being that stubborn. They do see a little bit of rifts and rafts, a little bit of high tides coming your way in regards to your relationship um due to this um you lie a lot you have lied a lot in this relationship so your angels are saying that it's best for you to kind of speak up in regards to certain matters um it's best that you do this okay just be a little bit more honest with your partner there's a lot of things that you have not told her, I'm being told, in regards to yourself. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna use this deck. I'm gonna use this deck. I don't want this video to be too long. And just any other messages you have in regards to this matter? Let me know which artists from the past or any current situations 
um, like this in regards to any person you would like me to do. Let me know down below. Okay, Angel, so there's any last messages in regards to this matter? Okay, these cards want to come out. As you guys saw, partnerships and love, despairs. Uh, Raspy is not gay. Rangers are saying, who has made a okay? There's not been a lot of accusations in regards to this that Angels are saying, but he's not gay. Um, he does like women, okay? So, um, yeah, so Rasby, if you're watching this, kind of, kind of like confirm it. Has he confirmed it? I keep on hearing talking about this matter. I don't know, okay? But they're saying that this is something that he really wants to stress to people that he's not gay. Okay, so hopefully that kind of brings that to light as well, I guess. So, yeah, so basically the angels have gave the answer since uh, they don't want to do polygraph test. Um, as you guys, like I said, you, you know angels don't lie. So um, hopefully you guys like watching this. Hopefully someone gets some truth and clarity in regards to this matter. Um, like I said, check down my shop down below and I will speak to you in the next video.